What's up guys? Hey everyone, it's Friday and I'm just messing around with my carpet here. Let's take a look back at this week at some of the best Android related stories. This week was super exciting with the launch of the new OnePlus 3 phone. For $399, you're going to be getting a 5.5 inch 1080p screen, a 16 megapixel camera, 6 gigabytes of RAM, and a Snapdragon 820 processor. For $399, that sounds about right, and I really like the OnePlus 2, so hopefully this phone will be good as well. The company is actually encouraging people to develop for it by releasing the device trees and the kernel sources for the public. In fact, some people have already started development on this device and an unofficial CyanogenMod build is already available for it, which is pretty sweet. Looks like OnePlus is embracing the development community like a bunch of large men hugging each other in a hot sauna. In other development news, you might be excited to learn that SlimROM has come out with a new Marshmallow-based ROM. You can check to see if your device is supported in the link in the description. It is always exciting when Snapchat comes out with new filters. This week they came out with this weird little panda thing. I think it's a red panda because of the th palm trees that I was holding. And I really like that filter. And Android N Developer Preview 4 has been released this week. So go ahead and check that out if you haven't yet. You can enroll your device in the beta program and get that OTA pushed to your phone. And the last thing I wanted to share with you guys is this video that Jared created talking about some of the lesser known features of the Galaxy S7 and the S7 Edge. If you own one of these devices, you'll definitely want to check out this video. There's a ton of cool stuff in there. Anyways, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to follow me on Twitter and um, just... Uh...